first of all, the, the general thoughts in terms of having a course. Uh, what was the reasoning behind having such a course? Here? Well, the main aim behind courses coming to Grenada going forward is to have all the coaches certified. Now, the C license, most people have done the D license already, right? Um, so the next step is a C. Our aim is to have all Premier League coaches and coaches that coach at the top level be certified at the highest uh, course that we have and, and C license is of such. So we had opened this to all the Premier League clubs and, um, and a few other coaches, national coaches that are presented, presented in the system. Any other courses planned? Definitely. The, the B license course now has been done in Jamaica by CONCACAF and that was a pilot project. We intend to get that here in Grenada, uh, maybe not this year, but very early next year. And then the Premier League coaches will have to, be, have to do that course. So every course, every level course that comes that's higher, our Premier League coach has to do it until we get to a level where we are comfortable and, and we top out at that course. I think it's a great opportunity for all our coaches in the nation and for their development. It will help the coaches to be more uh, effective with their coaching and it would help develop our players as they go along. Your thoughts on being part of the process of developing coaches here in Grenada? It's always great to be, you know, the first one to introduce the, the courses in, in the in the area, and that's the um, what Concacaf wants. You know, he wants they they want to deliver this uh, great uh, courses for the entire confederation. We have done many courses in the, in the Caribbean, in Central America, and Mexico. And now it's time to Grenada to host the the C license, which is a huge importance for their development of the youth. What level are we at and what are some of the improvements that we need to make in terms of CONCACAF itself? Well, I don't know specifically here in Grenada, but what I've seen in the Caribbean is just, uh, um, you know, it's very empirical the way that we teach uh, in some of the islands because it's something that we just learn from playing. But you know, it's very important that we understand the methodology and how useful it is for us to understand it and learn it so we can pass it in an easy way for our players to understand the game in a much better way. What are some of the short-term goals and some of the long-term goals in place to get us to that level? Well, the, the, the short term is to introduce these courses and the, the long term is to, from these courses that we teach in, identify local coaches that can become instructors so they can enter a program with that we have is train the trainers. So, you know, I love coming to Grenada and teach a course, but, you know, it will be great for Grenada to have three or four instructors locally so they can teach. Uh, their own coaches, that's the long term that CONCACAF wants to accomplish.